to always have time to listen to others. Because the Bible said that when you refuse to listen to somebody, when the time comes that you need someone to listen to you, nobody will be there for you. Automatically, this place is telling us that whatever we give to our neighbor, we are not giving it to that person, rather, we are helping ourselves. Are we together? Automatically, we are doing it for ourselves, but it's for our own good. When the Bible says we should love our neighbor as ourselves, meaning, with that, we don't have love in us, we cannot love others. Then we are doing our self harm by not loving others, because before you can be able to love somebody, then automatically you are already able to love yourself. Sexuality begins at home. Whatever the word of God is telling us to do is helping us to grow, to enrich our soul. It's telling us to enrich our soul. Don't think what you are giving to giving us. You are giving to someone. No, don't let them always let that on you. The talk that will be in us from today is that whatever I give at, I give it to myself. Because it is not the person you bless that will bless you back. You say, when I was tasting, you were not there for me. That's because when someone asks you to give him water to drink, you refuse to give. And when you are not in the need of it, there will not be nobody there that will also do for you. When you do for somebody in the time of your need, God will also cause somebody to be there for you. Praise God. Quickly, let's look at the book of Matthew 28, from 18 to 20. The book of Matthew.
God, when you give me money, you are not helping me. Praise God. The greatest gift that you and I can give to one another is the word of God. Praise God. It's the word of God. It's this choice that somebody can receive from you. It's very good when you see that people see you and be happy. To when you give someone money when you see you not be happy, you see you see me. Don't see the call. Don't want to show off. But when you, there are some things you can give out to somebody, when you see him, he will be happy because no, he's going to learn something new from you. Have you come and encounter with you? Change lives. That thing will always make people happy whenever they see you. There are people when you mention their name, there will, there will be no more everywhere. Say, mm -hmm. Praise God. But there are still people when you mention their name, they will like that. It's coming, I mean, they would like to see you. Not because you have money to share around, but because you have positive impacts. Impacts that you give to people. They want to be part of that impact. That is what the word of God says to you and I. That we should always give time. Give our time. Give the word. The word is there in us. We should give it out. We should not be stingy with the word of God. When you are being saved, there is a need for another person around you to also be saved. Praise God. He said, we should give the word, not materially, but spiritually. And that made the word the question. I said, when last did you talk about the commission given unto you? When last have you done the command of God that He has given you? It's a command. It's we should go here and multiply. It's a command. It's not a wish. So when last have you done that? Amen. Amen. To a Christian, to a believer, when last have you been able to win a soul, to bless a soul? Even if the person did not come with you, but he went to another church. When last have you done that? Praise Master Jesus. There is a need for you and I to always give out. There is a need for you and I to always share the grace that God has given to us. Say there is love in sharing. In Proverbs 30, he said, he said there, is, there is a blessing giving than receiving. Those that give is more blessed than those that are receiving. Are we together? Yes. Praise God. Amen. Say there is a blessing giving than those that are receiving. How many people have you given the word of God this week? How many people have you given just you are blessed? Spiritual blessing. But tell somebody that is blessed, you have blessed somebody already. How many people did you give that to this week? If we have not been doing that, there is a need for us to start it from now. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. Because of time, I will stop here and I would like to ask a question. Concerning what we have seen so far, what have we learned from this topic? Low moments, or let me come straight. What do we understand 